Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Once you've decided to start organizing your files and folders, you will want to move or copy files or folders to a new location. There is a difference between moving and copying files and folders. When you move a file or folder, you cut the original item and then paste it into a different location on your computer. When you copy a file or folder, you make an exact copy of the selected file or folder and then paste the copy into a new location in your computer. When you move a file, it is often referred to as cutting and pasting. When you copy a file, it is referred to as copying and pasting. You can cut or copy and then paste files in several different ways. One way is to navigate to the file or folder you want to cut or copy within File Explorer so you can see the icon for the file or folder you want to move or copy in the pane at the right side of the window. To use this method, make sure that you change the File Explorer window's size to Restore so that it is not maximized. Now open a second File Explorer window by clicking the File tab within the original File Explorer window and then choosing the Open New Window command in the drop-down menu that appears. Use this window to navigate to the folder where you want to paste the item that you will copy or move from the first window. Once again, ensure that this window is also using the Restore Window size and then place it next to the first window on screen. Then click and hold down on the file or folder from the first window, drag it into the second window, and drop it there by releasing your mouse button. If the files are located on the same computer drive, then doing this will cut and paste, or move, the item. If they are located on different computer drives, then doing this will copy and paste the item. If you wanted to copy the item, regardless of which drive the files are located within, then hold down the control key on your keyboard as you drag and drop the selected file or folder. You will notice a small plus sign appear next to your mouse pointer as you drag the item between the windows. That icon indicates that the file or folder is being copied versus being cut. Another way to cut, copy, and paste is to click an item in a File Explorer window that you want to cut or copy to select it. Then click either the Cut or Copy buttons that appear within the Clipboard button group on the Home tab within the ribbon. Then navigate to the folder into which you want to paste the item that you just cut or copied by using File Explorer. You can use the same window if desired. Then simply click the Paste button within the Clipboard button group on the Home tab in the ribbon to paste the item. Another way to cut, copy, and paste is to select the file or folder to cut or copy within the File Explorer window. Then click either the Move To or the Copy To buttons shown within the Organize button group on the Home tab in the ribbon depending on whether you want to move or copy the selected item. From the drop-down menu that appears, select the name of one of the recently accessed folders or libraries to paste the item into the selected folder. Note that you can also click the Choose Location command at the bottom of either drop-down menu to open a Move Items or Copy Items window. Within this window, you use the hierarchical folder navigation shown to select the destination folder into which you want the selected item to be moved or copied. You use this window to select a folder, just as you use the navigator in the pane at the left side of the File Explorer. Once you select the destination folder within this window, click either the Move or Copy button that appears at the bottom of the Move Item or Copy Item window to move or copy the selected item and close the window. A final way to cut, copy, and paste files and folders is by using the keyboard. To do this, first select the item to copy or move within the File Explorer, and then press either the Ctrl plus C keys on your keyboard to copy the item, or the Ctrl plus X keys on your keyboard to cut the item. Then navigate into the folder where you want to paste the item that you just selected. To then paste the item that you... Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.